Hello and welcome to another one of my videos. A few of you might recognize this shoe from about three years ago. I did a, a, a video on repairing it because uh, the sole had come adrift from the upper and I was able to repair it with two strings and a piece of wire. Well, it lasted me a good three years, but a few weeks ago I was up a tree like 60 meters up in the air cutting the top off it and unfortunately it came adrift. So I was going to throw it out because it basically has done its dash, but I thought I'd seen a video a little while ago about some people in Asia who were able to sew their shoe together with one string. And so I thought I'd give it a try. And it looks, I did. And it looks like this. It was actually a lot quicker and easier to do than the other way, but I'm not sure how long it'll last because it's only one string. And if it snaps, it may unravel. I don't know. I know that the two strings didn't unravel, even though it's scuffed and worn through on the toe. So I'll show you how I did that. It only needs a nail and some string. Let's give it a go. So I'm going to use some nice thick thread, almost string, and also a three inch nail. But I'm going to cut a bit of a hook in the end to act as an awl. Now with the nail in the vise, I took a triangular file and then filed a bit of a groove in there. Then with a hacksaw, I was able to cut an undercut into that groove and also go right round both sides. So it's going to form like a harpoon shape so that it's going to grab that thread and pull it through. I could put that in a wooden handle, but I'm just going to get a pair of vice grips and clamp that well in there to, to give me something to handle with. So the technique, just skewer through there, making sure you don't skewer your fingers until you've got it through to the other side. Get your string and hook it over that thread and pull it through. Move along a little bit more, skewer it through and hook that string over the point again and pull it through then pull your threads tight so that you've now got it tight and go for the next thread and just continue that way a lot quicker and simpler so you skewer it go through without skewering your fingers take the string Hook it over the end of it, maintaining a little bit of pressure so you can get it through, pulling up the slack as you go so that you can then tighten it, then pull up the slack. Next one. Now on the last stitch I'm going to snip that through. Now I'm going to come from the inside and hook that last string through. and then tie it off. Now that took about 30 or 40 minutes. I think they look quite stylish. I think we could start a new fashion. 